Come through here. This is our front room. We uh, sorry, it's a bit bare. We find furniture very conformist. We threw, threw it all out. <laughs> well, this is where, where Lenny and I live. We're very happy here. Very happy indeed. He'll be around in a minute, I expect, with some flowers for me. He always brings me flowers. <sighs> oh God, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. It's very embarrassing. I, I didn't mean to. It's just that, well, it's over. It's over between me and Lenny Henry. He, um, he doesn't find me funny anymore. He wanted to go off and find someone else. I mean, I gave, I gave that guy all my best gags. We married in uh, 1984, and it's been brilliant, of course. Uh, she's been an incredibly stabilising influence on my life and, of course, in my career, both politically and uh, with the kind of material I do. And uh, she, more than anybody else, really made me think about the sort of stuff I was doing. Uh, the press, of course, think that uh, two comedians must spend the whole time cracking gags. If only they knew. There were the lies. There were lies. There was a major lie that he... he well, he told everyone else, because he didn't tell me. And, Eventually, I discovered, and uh, well, apparently, apparently, it transpired that, uh, well, uh, he's black, and um, I never knew. My mother, my mother suspected, of course, but he just, he never told me. Anyway, you know, he's gone, he's gone, and that's fine. Right now.